Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. This is going to be a general reading for the person on your mind. We're going to take a look and see how they see you, how they feel about you, what are their intentions and their next actions. Keep in mind this is a general reading. Only take what resonates, leave the rest. Feel free to check out your moon placement. The timestamps will be listed down below. Don't forget to please like and subscribe so you don't miss out next time I do upload a new video. If you want your own personalized reading, my website is TimelessDivineTarot.com or you can contact me with my email, which is listed down below, TimelessDivineTarot at gmail.com. We are going to start with Aries first. I will list the timestamps down below. Let's get a couple of letters first for some names. We have U, W, A, I, Y, Z. Zany, Amy, Zena, Sir, Air, Wanda, Upile, Sarah. Okay, Aries, let's see the person on your mind. How do they see you in the current energy? The person on your mind. Rena, Reza. Okay, so we have the Four of Swords. They see you as somebody who is very laid back, very peaceful, very easygoing. How do they feel about you? The two of wands, they could feel that you are waiting or maybe you're a little bit distant right now. Maybe you're not taking action towards them. What are their intentions? The Knight of Cups, this is somebody who is intending to come towards you with some type of feeling and emotion. They want to express what they are thinking and feeling. Let's see what their next actions are, Aries. Winona, Winnie, Six of Cups, Justice. And the Magician. This is somebody who has a history with you, Aries. This is someone who is thinking about the past. They're very nostalgic. And the truth is, you are everything they truly desire with that Magician card. They feel that you are somebody that has the full package. That you have your life together. You have everything that they truly desire when it comes to somebody as far as companionship, compatibility. And this is something that this person is intending to come towards you with expressing these feelings and emotions that they are thinking about when it comes to you. Your channeled song is Lonely by Shaggy. Taurus, 258. Okay, Taurus, let's get some letters for some names. We have U, O, Omar, Z, Zoe, Zane, Zaina, A, P, Zappy, S, Steven, George, and Archie, I'm hearing. Alabama, Winnie, the person on your mind, Aries, or I'm sorry, excuse me, Taurus, the person on Taurus's mind, how do they see you? Cole, we have the Nine of Cups, they see you as somebody who's very independent, somebody who's very happy, very much living your best life. How they feel about you is the seven of pentacles. They feel that you are worth investing in, that they want to put their time and their efforts into getting to know you more. Their intentions is the queen of cups. They're intending to get really comfortable with these feelings and emotions about you, and they're hoping that you will get comfortable with them. Their next actions, the world, the three of wands, and the fool. This is somebody who, if they live at a physical distance, they are wanting to come towards you. They're wanting to be closer towards you. They're having a little bit of patience right now, but they are thinking about taking a leap of faith and possibly coming and traveling and to be closer to you. Your channeled song is Never Too Much by Luther Vandross. Gemini. Four fifty one. Okay, Gemini, let's get a couple of letters for names. J, 
X, E, Jacob, Jax, O, Joe, I, H, Joey, Henry, Henrietta, Warren, Ronnie, Yuri, Warren is coming up again, Warlinda, Jake, hey Gemini, let's see the person on your mind. This could be an ex of yours that you are thinking about. Let's see how they see you in the current energy. The temperance. So they see you as somebody who is very patient, very kind. They also see that you're somebody who is very laid back. And you could be coming across as a very easygoing energy. How they feel about you is the Page of Cups. They feel that they want to say something to you. They want to communicate something to you. Their intentions is the lovers. So they are intending to hopefully have you choose them. If this is an ex for you, Gemini, this is somebody who wants to reconcile things. They do feel a strong soulmate connection with you. They do feel a strong bond with you. Their next actions is the Page of Swords, the King of Cups, and the Emperor. This is somebody who is waiting with their emotions and feelings. They're not ready to express it, but they are going to take the lead or take charge. We also have the strength card being hidden at the bottom of the deck. So this is somebody who is still building up their strength and courage to have the willpower to come towards you. But right now, they are waiting, they are observing, and they are watching you in this current energy. Your channeled song is When You Say Nothing At All by Allison Cross. Kraus, I think is how you say it. Okay, Cancer, 703. Okay, Cancer, the person on your mind, let's get some letters and names. G, Gino, Gina, X, T, U, A, E, Taney, Tanya, Lotus, Gallagher, Aola, Tawanda, Gary, hey Cancer, the person on your mind, how do they see you? Allie, the Justice, they see you as somebody who does the right thing, that you always try to do the right thing and you're very truthful. How they feel is the Eight of Cups, they feel that you did disconnect from them. That maybe there were blockages or there were challenges. Maybe this person had a lot of issues with the law or legal issues. And even though you had feelings and emotions for this person, they do feel that you needed to walk away from the situation. Their intentions is the Seven of Pentacles. They're thinking long and hard about the history the two of you did share. That they did invest in this connection just as much as you did. 818 could be very significant or relevant to you, Cancer, with this person. Could be the month, could be the birthday, could be dates that something happened between the two of you. Let's see what their next actions are because they're intending to invest. We do have the Page of Swords, the Lovers, and the Eight of Swords. So this is somebody who does love you, but they are waiting because they're caught up in their head. They have a lot of negative thoughts because of maybe the truth of what their past is that they know that you needed to disconnect because you did not want to be involved with whatever they were involved with, especially if it was something against the law, something you didn't agree with. Even though they did invest in this connection, they understand that you had to disconnect or you had to walk away. So right now, they're not taking any action. They do feel that maybe it was fated for the two of you to go in separation at this time, and they don't blame you. They understand that you shouldn't be a part of it. Channeled Song is Rumor Has It by Adele. Leo, nine twenty-five. Okay, Leo, the person on your mind. Let's get some letters and some names. O R E F V M. Michael, Ray, Victor, Faye, Zyra. Remy, Olina, 
the person on Leo's mind, Eric, how do they see you? Seven of Cups, they see you as a fantasy or an illusion to them right now. They could feel like you're untouchable. They could see you as someone who has a lot of options. How they feel about you is the Knight of Swords. They feel that they need to communicate something with you really quickly. They could feel like you also are very um, aggressive with your communication. Their intentions is the Empress. So this is somebody who intends to still nurture and care for this connection. They do see and recognize who you are to them. Their actions is the Five of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, and the Ace of Cups. Even though you may have walked away from this person and left them out in the cold, they're going to come back around. They want to come back towards you. They are wanting this new opportunity. They're coming in passionate with the Knight of Wands, but they're coming with the intention of opening up their feelings and their emotions towards you, Leo. The channeled song is Chasing You by Morgan Wallen. Virgo, 1104. Okay, Virgo, the person on your mind. Letters and names. We have KT, Katie, Kate, Caitlin, S, P, Stephanie, Paul, W, Q, Lori, Oscar, Sandry, Tony, Patricia, Virgo, the person on your mind. How do they see you? How do they feel about you? What are their intentions and next actions? How they see you? Eight of Swords. They see you as somebody who is really caught up in your head that maybe you have a lot of negative thoughts or beliefs when it comes to them. How they feel about you is the Six of Swords. They feel that you're moving away, that you're transitioning. Maybe you're getting more quiet and not communicating as much. Their intentions is the Five of Pentacles. They feel left out in the cold. That wasn't what they intended to do, but maybe you did disconnect from them and they do feel that. Their next actions is the Knight of Swords. Ace of Cups, and Temperance. This is somebody who is coming in aggressively with communication. They are running back to you if you disconnected from them. They want to have a conversation. They want to be very clear about these feelings and emotions that they have. They want to open up and express something to you, Virgo. They're thinking a lot about they've been patient long enough. Maybe they've been waiting for you to say something or come back around and you haven't. And now that time is of the essence, this person feels like now's the time. They've been patient long enough. They're ready to try to heal things with you. So they are going to come back, but they're coming back with this aggressive communication. Like, why haven't you contacted me? Or why haven't you tried to come back? So they want to know. The channeled song is For Once in My Life by Stevie Wonder. Libra. 1313. Could be dealing with the Scorpio, Libra. The person on your mind could be a Scorpio. Let's get some letters and some names. L, X, Xavier, Z, Y, Yazzie, D, Dan, Daniel, Dano, Abel, Abel, Bo, Donna, Lexi, Leah, Lee, Libra, the person on your mind, how do they see you? Nine of Cups, they see you as a wish fulfillment, as a fantasy. They see you as somebody who is really happy with being independent, being single. How do they feel about you? Five of Swords, they're really conflicted about the communication the two of you maybe had the last time. Their intentions is the Ace of Pentacles. They're coming towards you with the intentions of an opportunity. They want to have an opportunity. What is their next actions? The Two of Pentacles, the world, the devil. This person is obsessed with trying to close out the past with you being single. They maybe feel like you are juggling them with someone else, that you are single. Maybe that was part of the conflict. They felt like you were not making them a priority. And that's because you're single and independent, looking good, feeling good. And they see you as this fantasy that they want to be. But they are juggling with, they don't know that you're actually going to take them and want to be with them. 
They are very obsessed with the thought of you rejecting them. But this is somebody who wants to close out the past and try to figure out what the future will be. The channeled song is Sorry by Justin Bieber. Scorpio, 1510. All right, Scorpio, let's get some letters and some names. Scorpio, I... T O T O L X O Lonnie Lennox Riley Ryson Tammy Timmy Lottie Ryan I think I said Ryan Hey Scorpio the person on your mind how do they see you could be a Leo you're dealing with. Okay, we have the Seven of Wands. So they see you as somebody who is pushing them away. They see you as somebody who is guarded. They also see you as a challenge. How they feel about you, the Eight of Cups, they feel that you are walking away or you have already walked away. They feel that you do have feelings and emotions, but maybe you felt like there was too much feelings and emotions for you to not want to stay, that there was too much that you felt in regards to them and the situation that you needed to disconnect. Their intentions, here's Leo coming out, strong energy here, uh, Scorpio. So their intentions is to build up their strength and courage. They are trying to gain the willpower to understand exactly what it is that they need to do. They're trying to figure out how they can build up their strength and courage about what their intentions are. Their next actions, the Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Five of Swords. This person's very conflicted. They're going to work really hard, maybe at their job, their career. They're going to focus on their independence, but they are wanting to fight for you, but they're not going to take any action with this communication just quite yet. Yeah, they have a lot of love for you with that Queen of Cups hidden at the bottom of the deck. Channel song is Before I Go by Maze. Sagittarius, 1725. Okay, Sagittarius, the person on your mind. Let's get some letters and some names. Y-E-T-L-I-X. Terry, Brian, Aaron, Irene. Erica, Tony, Lix, Ronnie, Rhea. Okay, Sagittarius, the person on your mind, how do they see you right now? Eli, Elton, the Justice. They see you as somebody who's trying to live in your truth. They see you as somebody who's very fair and balanced. How they feel about you is the Three of Cups. They feel that you're somebody that they like to go out with, they like to spend time with, that you have maybe a lot of friends, you like to socialize. Their intentions is the Five of Pentacles. They're intending to maybe walk away from the situation. Maybe they feel like there is not a true alignment here, that maybe you're just friends and there's not a strong compatibility here. Their actions, we have the Magician, Page of Swords, Queen of Cups. This is somebody who has feelings and emotions for you, but they feel like they need to just wait and not do anything because what they desire is more than maybe what you desire. And that's how they see you. They see you living in your truth that maybe you just want to be friends with this person and you actually don't want to be in a relationship with them. And they know that. Maybe you even told them that. Channeled song is It's My Life by Bon Jovi. Nineteen twenty-two for Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn, the person on your mind. Let's get some letters and some names. W O Winona, Wanda C Y A Cindy, Sia, Lisa, Connie, Abigail, Zita. 
Hey Capricorn, the person on your mind, how do they see you? The Nine of Cups. Okay, they see you as a someone who looks good, feels good, does the what you want. You're really happy and emotionally stable. How they feel about you? Seven of Swords. They could feel like maybe um, you're not being fully transparent with them. Their intentions? The Empress. Okay, they intend to try to nurture this connection. They intend to still invest and see where things go between the two of you. What's their next actions? The Hierophant. Three of Wands and the King of Wands. This is somebody who is feeling inspired to come towards you. If they live at a distance, Capricorn, they want to travel to come see you, but they are committed. They are definitely committed. They feel like they need to take the lead. They're trying to understand that Seven of Swords on how they feel. They feel like maybe you're keeping something from them, and especially if there's distance there. They could feel that there is something that they don't understand or they don't know. Maybe their intuition is telling them that you are keeping something from them and they're trying to figure that out. That could be why they're trying to come towards you. The channeled song is Remember the Time by Michael Jackson. Aquarius 2121. Okay, Aquarius, let's get some letters and some names. Aquarius. B, X, Baxter, W, P, Paul, Polly, Q, U, Quincy, Yolanda, Audrey, Benny, Bennett, Aurora, Winifred, the person on your mind, Aquarius, how do they see you? The Hierophant. They see you as somebody who really knows who you are. You have strong morals and strong values. They see you as somebody who could be marriage material, commitment material. How they feel about you is the two of wands. That maybe you're waiting. Maybe they feel intuitively that you're going to take action towards them. There could be distance here between the two of you. But this is somebody who feels the distance and they feel like they need to wait. Their intentions is temperance. This is somebody who's having patience. That's, their, that's what their intentions is. They're patiently waiting to see what you are going to do. Their next actions, the Queen of Swords, Six of Wands, High Priestess. This is somebody who is being very clear with listening to their communication. They're being very direct. They're thinking towards the future. They're thinking towards long term. This is somebody who, with their actions, they want to come towards you, but their intuition is telling them to wait. Don't say anything just quite yet. Allow Aquarius a little bit more time. Give them a little bit more patience and hold back. Use your intuition to guide you before taking any action. And that's what they're intending to do is listen to their intuition. Their channeled song is Too Good at Goodbyes by Sam Smith. Pisces, 2335. Okay, Pisces, the person on your mind, let's get some letters and some names. We have I, U, E, E, G, Gina, Gina, Y, Ryan, Stefan, Franny, Linda, Irene, Abigail, George. Hey, Pisces, how does the person on your mind see you? Page of Swords. They see you as somebody who is very wise and very observant that you don't miss anything. You also maybe cut things out of your life that are not necessary. How they feel about you is the Empress. They feel that you are somebody who's very caring, very nurturing, and you really do invest in yourself and those around you. Their intentions is the moon. So they are holding back how they feel about you for the time being. 
Let's see their next actions. We have three of pentacles. This could be somebody that you are in the friend situation with. There we go. Three of cups, double threes, and the wheel of fortune. So this person is waiting on divine timing, waiting to see if that this is a cycle of will things change. They do have feelings for you, but this is somebody that you're friends with. So they're not wanting to tell you their feelings and emotions. They are going to hold back for right now. So what is the channeled song for Pisces? Forget Me by Lewis Capaldi. Let's 